there wasn't really a job description for what I wanted to do. You know, people don't hire storytellers, much less adventure storytellers. That was my dream. I mean, I was that six-year-old kid you'd see with his face buried in National Geographics. I knew there was magic in life on the road. I loved climbing. I loved being outside. I would load all this stuff up into my car, leave the city, and I'd spend a couple months out on the road, and then I'd come back home, and I'd write it all down. But I wound up with all these stories I'd gathered from my time on the road, and I just, I couldn't sell them anywhere. I was about to give up when I had this realization that nobody was gonna give me this job. I had to go create it. Once I realized that, it was like the horizon opened up. I started a radio show in my closet. I went on to make films. We found our community. It's seven years later, and I'm still basically doing the same thing. I'm loading up gear, putting it in the car, and hitting the road to go spend time with the people that inspire me in places that inspire me. That process has come full circle, right back to where my dream started. When National Geographic asked me to help with Adventures of the Year, the six-year-old boy in me kind of chuckled. We pulled together 10 incredible stories, 10 incredible feats from people who live life on their own terms. I think it would be easy to put these people up on a pedestal, to think of them as heroes or almost superhuman. And while talent plays a role in these people's feats and their successes, it's not what makes their ideas a reality. It's grit, creativity, passion, kindness, and love. That's the human spirit. I know in my heart I could be an adventure of the year, but that's not what I want to do. I want to tell stories, spend as much time as I can outside, and pass that love for it along to my son. My struggles to make my dreams a reality have taken just as much commitment as paddling into a big wave or climbing a peak in the Karakoram. There's a lot of ways to take risks in life. That's, that's the magic of it. I know this, you have to do the thing that makes you tick. You have to do it on a daily basis. You have to do it unapologetically. Do it with love.